everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Alive. And would you believe there's a reason why we are here? I think you probably already know, right? So I apologize. I think in the last video, I was slightly out of focus the whole time. I realized that I had that set to like manual focus. And like it was slightly, I was slightly like, it was the, the microphone was perfectly in focus. Whereas now I can see quite clearly that if I get closer, it's going to focus on me. And there we go further away. There we go. We're good. We're good. We, we, you know, these issues we should have cleared up years ago. No. <laughs> so, we are back in Jurassic World Alive. And what has changed? Um, ooh, the bed. Well, we got to dot the bed, don't we? Yes, we do. So, there is coming up the end of the uh, Aerodactyl or Dreadactylus, I think, um, event. Uh, so I think within this weekend it should be over and by the time, well, by the time this video is up, it'll definitely be over. And I just want to say a big thank you to everybody in the Alliance who contributed to it. Um, because we got like, if you're level 20, then all level 20s have got the thing unlocked. It's like rank 8 or something like that. Very good, very good. Um, and if all of the people who didn't donate, unfortunately, will be kicked <laughs> by. <laughs> oh, it's hard finding good workforce around you in these parts. But anyway, we're here because, oh, I can't believe this one. <laughs> but that's just so goddamn funny. Look at this. 90, 90 quid. Hey, quick. What was that in dollar dues? What What is that? I mean, I'm not meaning Australian dollars. <laughs> That's what, legit what they call it. Um, it was that like $150. Is it? Is it? If it's only if it's $99, you're actually getting a steal in comparison to what this is. But I, this is really expensive. <laughs> is it worth it? Well, you get 15,000 bucks. You have 400 Rexy, which if you haven't got Rexy, I guess you you unlock it and you level up maybe a couple of times, maybe two 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 four, two or three times. Uh, but also, you get two attack boosts, two health boosts, and one speed boost, as well as an incubator, which, what what you get in this? You could get Giga, which I guess, I suppose, isn't so bad. You've, I mean, you've got a high chance of getting Giga. Uh, Agrocanthosaurus also is needed for a certain hybrid. I can't exactly remember what hybrid it is. Also, hopefully the microphone audio is okay. I've got, like, an AC working beneath me, like a portable AC unit. Hopefully, you don't hear, like... Because I can. <laughs> but this microphone's very good. I point it away from the AC and we'll, we'll be fine. So, yeah. This, I mean, I said I was going to do it, right? I, I've committed to this because once I get this to level 30, fully boosted, I want to make sure that Ludia does not nerf it. Or at least if they do nerf it, I hold them accountable. I'm, I've still got that video in mind of like I was scammed out of and then I'll count up how much money and Ludia scammed me out of this much money. As much as like... <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't I don't want them to do that because it's a bad business practice. There's no no excuse. Any other line of work where you put money into something and then all of a sudden paid for this product or this produce and then it's just changed. They should be held accountable. I feel like when I say this as well, I have to do it under hushed tones because it's it's just not right. It's embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> like, but I have said in the past, and you'll see we've already got a 26 ready to level up. I've said in the past that all the money I make from, you know, Dresser World Live videos over the years, um, it, it basically just goes back into it. So, I, I think I saw a comment of like, you know, well, they, they, I get, they get free advertisement, and <laughs> all the money I make goes back into the game. So it's a win-win! Look at your win! But we'll see what we get in here. So you get even more coin, which I'm really not fussed about because now we have 6 million. Uh, this is all the incubators I've had to open, by the way, in order to get a Rexy. If it has Rexy DNA in it and you've seen it, oh, that's really good. Um, I've, I've done it. I've already, I've already bought it and tried to. And already there's like a tw level 28 uh, Rexy floating around in uh, Nublar Shores in the highest uh, tournament there's a level 28 and this is before this has came out which gives you basically 800 um so somebody like me has opened them all but they got lucky so they've opened the the legendary incubators and got the 200 dna maybe multiple times uh whereas i i think i've only ever got it like twice once or twice i think i've only ever got it by pure dumb luck um so uh, <laughs> so that's it there we go there we go we have how much two thousand two hundred so already we're not going to have enough for level 20. It just shows you how much or how expensive it basically gets to get level 30. That final push to get Rexy at level 30 is redonkulous. Um, I need to now put the entire... I spent a thousand pound on this. Because <laughs> already that's like 200 right there. And like I said, I will do it when we get this to level 30. I will have a look through 
and just see how much I've spent on this because I'll see the video when Rexy was released and then all the incubators I've bought have just been Rexy DNA. So, <laughs> oh, that was that was a decent. Oh, I'm getting very generous with with this. That's not, however, that was awful. And then I'll get like a tiny. Okay, oh, I got more of that. Okay, but there it is. There it freaking is. Oh my god. So we actually have a level 30 Ankylosaurus. I don't know if I put that in the last video, but we have that now. We've also got level 29 Paratops. Um, we're sort of getting there with all the other dinosaurs. So we'll level up Rexy because we have to. This is the most expensive dinosaur in the entire game. Just wait till they put the Jurassic Park 3 Spinosaur in. <laughs> you think I'm joking? It's gonna happen, just you wait. So, here we go. It was 120,000 to get it to the next level. And finally, I'll be... I'm less likely now to get one hit KO'd by friggin' Forex. And to be fair, I should probably now put in uh, more health boosts. Because I should have two to put in. Six, seven. So, I could put in two, which would take me to like 5,500. Which is now just pushing me out of a Forex being able to kill me in one hit if I did that. However, I'm really tempted to just go all attack. Can you imagine it? At, like, full power attack, doing your dominant roar and then fierce devour rampage. It would be ridiculous. I think what people have said is actually because the attack boost goes on before you attack, technically, look at Defense Shadow and Revenge to see how much damage your dominant roar will do, as long as they don't have armor, of course. So, we've got that. Um, I'm very tempted. We've got now, i got four attack boosts, 11 health boosts, and 13 speed boosts. So, I I, I kind of want to now try for the Giga, the Giga hybrid, because I, I, I've heard rumor that that's really good. You guys can tell me in the comments if it is, but I don't think there's any harm, especially, with, you know, the amount of coin I've got now with leveling this thing up, or at least, you know, getting it to a high level. So, I, ooh, 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 can we do 20? <gasps> we can almost do 20. Can we do 50? We could do 50, so we need 2,000. Should we just do a 50 pop and just see how much we get with one, one go? Like, we should do that. Okay, so I need to get this quite high level, and already I've got, yeah, 100. There you go, there you go. Some, some decent ones. I can't remember what we needed, but I think that's done it. <laughs> Don't know about you. I think that might have done it. So, we'll go on to Gigan, Giganix, and that is 50. Yeah, there it is. So, 10,000 Giga DNA. Just how much? Of course, it's the highest we got was 50s. So, 1,100. Um, so, it's probably going to get us to level 25, 26, I would say. We'll have a look. We'll have a look. I'm curious. So, there's a 25% chance to crit. And also, what's really good about this is the Ferocious Restore. Um, because you can get that right off the bat. And the Crushing Alert Showdown, I think, is good as long as you've got over half health to swap in. It's a, it's a really odd one, but I just I love how just bonkers that is to just... You know what? We're going to make a dinosaur that it can heal its opponent. It wants a fair fright. It's got honor. It's beautiful. So all of the Giga DNA will go into this. I'm assuming... You know, we're not going to get any more, um, you know, other hybrids from a Giga. Unless Rexy gets a hybrid. Imagine that. They put Rexy and Giga give a hybrid. Ooh. So I think we should be at level 27? Maybe? Is it a push? Oh, we're 50 off. I don't even think we can do a single. Oh, we can do two fuses. Can we get 50 out of it? Oh, it's, a, it's yeah, that's going to be... We're going to need some luck with this one. Definitely. We need a 30... Fingers crossed, touch wood. Uh, of course, yo. <laughs> Our sly underhanded dealings don't end there. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we'll um, probably put loads of boosts on our Paratops because we're just that kind of guy. So we have how much more? We got two more to put on. We, we can definitely put two more. <laughs> and there it is. A fully maxed Paratops. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the worst thing in the world to come across. It swaps in, it does damage, it heals, and buggers off. <laughs> yes. So, we got one more, and we can probably put the rest on the health, because we don't need speed, because that's not what we use Paratops for. So, uh, Referantum, fully maxed. Gorgotrebex, fully maxed. Uh, I think we've also got a fully maxed attack. And the saw looks at this 2,000 damage on a, on a, on a uh, the, the counter. Hydroboa is also maxed. Scorpius Strike is also maxed. Um, Rexy is, I think, I mean, we, we can definitely do two more. I'm very tempted just to, just to push over a little bit of health. I mean, we've still got three levels to go. 
So it's probably going to take us to like 6,000 health and probably more. If I mean, we level up once. Yeah, 5,700. So it will be like 6,000 odd health. With the remainder three boosts, I'm just going to put into attack because, I mean, 130 speed is pretty decent, especially when you get that speed bonus. I think we're good. I think we're good. Battle of one. Woo! It is a Rexy and Anglosolo. I, you know what? I always find the best thing to do. Anglosolo. Just throw it in there. And against this, actually, you know what? It's not so bad because we're going to put um, the vulnerability onto him. He's, he's probably going to go for his... Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got the yawn. Don't you love it? Normally, people who yawn are the ones that have, like, you know, the creatures that are annoying. <laughs> so here we go. And they count it. Look at the damage. Oh, 2,000. And then, I mean, we could just go for this and possibly stun him. And I'm kind of tempted to. You may... Oh, he's actually swapping out. Interesting. Has he taken me below half health? He has taken me below half health. Sweet. So even if he comes in and breaks the thing. Oh, a Scorpius Rex. Ooh. That's good, actually. That's really good on his part because now that he's done that, he's probably... I mean, he'll get to go first next turn and then he'll try and get the stun and the bleed. And if he does get that off, it's not going to be good for me. I'm going to survive, but is it much of a life? I don't know. Right. Okay. So... What we think? He's going to go for the stun. Hmm. I think we might as well just go for our own because we can swap an Anglosaur looks now and get invincibility for like two turns. So we're good with that. Anglosaur's ready to set up and do some damage. So we got our own Scorpius Rex to, you know, take off his attack because we really need that taken off. And now does he get through the block is the question. He doesn't get the crit and there you have it. Beautiful. So actually we're joint speed. So I'm going to tap as fast as I can. Oh, there we go. He's still got his dodge on? Oh my god, and he does get it! And then he's gonna do his big hit and cleanse. Oh, okay, okay. I was tempted to go for the regular one, but I thought, you know what? If I get through here and do a lot of damage and get my crit, I'll be happy. Oh, we survived! We've survived! Sweet, yes! Uh, he might swap out now, though. I, he's gotta have something to do a little bit of damage, right? You've got to. It's gotta be something. Ah, there it is. There is it maxed. Oh, it's not. And it's it's a rank 30 though. If I had the yawn, I would do the yawn now, but I'll do I'll do the rolling eye. I think rolling eyes is more insulting than a yawn. <laughs> ah, this thing, I see. <laughs> so, what should we do here? If we hmm. Humdy humdy hum. I kinda want Rexy to go in. I feel like it's gonna throw the game. But having a Rexy. I mean what, I went for the instant boost and then he would gone for his tough group group of cunning and then he would have went for his alert instant heal i think it, there's a better chance of me just stunning him outright and getting a good bleed head off and then it's up to him it's up to him whether he wants to stay in and heal do we get it do we get the stun oh it's still not a thing anymore i, I keep forgetting the icon's still there but hey ho <laughs> is it gonna heal are you going to go for the heal my friend Oh, you! Oh, yes. It's one of those. It's one of those, guys. Oh, yes. <laughs> so, now what do we do? Hmm. He doesn't have some... Oh. Oh, let's give him a t taste of his own medicine, shall we? <laughs> let's swap out to Anglosaur Lux. He'll go for, like, his big hit, knowing that he can cleanse against it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. There's nothing... Are you going to be stunned as well, my friend? No. <laughs> Oh, what's that? Nothing. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I love to see it. All right, now he's definitely going to swap out. He's not He's not going to be happy with this. He's going to swap out. And then, I mean, even if he swaps in, he can't kill me in one hit. Which is good, because if it was a max level, actually, even a max level Paratox, I don't think would be able to. Um, so this is actually really bad for him because I'm going to take off his dodge and I'm also going to take off... I'm going to give him vulnerability, take off his dodge and then hit him with a big hit. So he's basically dead. He's just died. Uh, I don't think he knew that that's the way it was going to go. He probably hit me with a yawn because he didn't predict that. I mean, he's obviously wanted to save that. He's also got a full Rex as his icon, so he might have that on his team. Uh, oh, it's a Mort! It's a Morty! Um, is he, he's probably going to kill me in one hit with his raw. Yeah, he is. Oh, very good. Very good. Okay. Oops. <laughs> oh, this guy's being very sarcastic. I love that. I don't know why people do this. Like, every... 
all the top tier dinosaurs in the game are like annoying to face up against. Come on. Uh, so what do we do? I think we just got to go against Ref here. We got to go against Ref. Um, we've got to lower his attack. I mean, we could just completely nullify it here. And I'm kind of tempted to do that. Just, just to make sure that he doesn't do anything. Okay. Okay. He predicted that. Well predicted, actually. Well predicted. Um, hmm. Hmm. I mean, he's going to go for the heal. It's 100% it's going to happen. But... He might die. This is the thing. Um, I need to keep this priority. Yeah, okay, okay, he's dead. He's dead. Okay. Doesn't matter what happens here. Even if Mortem comes in, we've survived. I think. I think we have. It could be it could be clutch. If he gets a crit and then he does his roar. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. He's not faster, even though he's put some speed boosts on it. He's not gonna get stunned. Right, here we go. So what does I what does the attack get reduced by? Oh, to zero. Oh, this is good. This is really good. Right, what are you going to do, son? Oh, you're going to do no damage to me. Oh, wh wh what's your play here? What's your play? I mean, you get some attack back. You can do your roar, I suppose. But then if I just nullify you, it's not going to do... I mean, you're still going to hit me, I suppose, here. Uh, yeah, let's just do this. Uh, let's see. If you get to crit, he's killed me. Ah, oh, come on! Really? Really? The freaking crit. The freaking crit got him the kill. Ah, oh, that's unlucky. That's unlucky. Damn. Damn that. Well, that's the way sometimes it goes, unfortunately. He got very lucky. He got crits, and then he didn't get stunned a couple of times. <laughs> Yay! And, and also, when I was hitting with my Scott Boost Rex, he, his dodge worked. So I think it was just the, the RNG gods there was not going to win. Okay, just realized I probably su should have switched to T-Rex there. I think I could have won if I'd done that. Or at least it depended what his other dinosaur was. I can't even remember. Anyway, should have, should have switched to T-Rex. And it's a whole Apex team. Oh, I don't really like to have that. But um, not not because I think it's OP, but because it's kind of like, oh, okay. <laughs> so does it even stun anymore? Is there... No, okay, so there's no chance to stun. Interesting. But you'll get the bleed off, I suppose. So it does go through Cloak, but it doesn't stun anymore. Gotcha. We'll get there eventually. So I think it's dead. <laughs> yes, I think it is. It might have some resistance to it, but uh, yeah, it's about to get ultimately patied. Yes. Now that bleed's going to do a lot of damage. Yes. I suppose. Okay, so ref is actually gone. That's pretty, that's a big deal on a team. If you've got a ref, you're like, okay, I'm, I'm good to do a lot of damage. And I guess he did. But a Hydra Boa now. Ooh, I mean, he's going to go first, but I don't. Mm, I don't know if this is going to be really good for him. Oh, the slippery. The slippery. Oh, well then. Uh, still not very good for him. Because <laughs> I get to... Uh, I mean, he does his attack. Okay, this will be interesting because I get a shield. Oh my god, am I going to kill him on the passive? I think he gets to heal though when I swap. Does he heal first? He might not heal first. Oh, he does heal first. Okay, okay. Well... Oh! <laughs> you know what? Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. I'll take that. Right, so what are you going to do, son? What are you going to do? I mean, he's going to go for his Fable Fangs, I'd assume. I mean, just so he could get the crit and the high rate of damage. That's okay. We're 2 nil up. This is looking very promising for me. And we can get some very quiet uh, MLG horns. Sweet. <laughs> right, that's that kill. Next. Whoa, 700 damage. I am... Uh, this, whatever comes in is a good chance to kill me. Oh, a Spino Constrictor also makes an elephant sound. You've got to love it. Uh, now, he has no priority except for instant distraction. I guess I just go for this. I mean, yeah, if he I think I'm immune to it. Yeah, distract. Okay. So, he went for a snakey snake team, a sneaky snake team, and we take him down to exactly 2,000. Mm. <laughs> and there it goes. Okay, well done. Well done. You did good. You killed one of me dinos. And now... I mean, I guess we just put Hydro Bow in. Or we could put this the Crocodile in just to make sure that he can't do anything. But to be fair, the Hydro Bow is better at keeping something in. Just because I've got the priority. And I've also... I don't take any... What's it called? Any... Yeah, I've basically won this. Even if he distracts me, I'm immune to it. If he swaps out, I kill him. Yeah, pretty much GG. Well done. I, I say good luck to him. Because 
Uh, you know, we like to be a sportsman. Oh, did he just rage quit? <laughs> I think he might just rage quit. Well, there you go. Beautiful. Uh, one, one, one for two. One for two. Not bad. We'll do one more. Uh, if, if we get like a good... If, I want Rexy and... I don't know, something else on the team. I don't know what, but I'm, I'm looking for something. Oh, also, a quick break to just do a cut. Oh. A couple of these. Go on, then. What we got? What we got? You got... Oh, it's a Rexy, and it's an Anglosaur Lux. I find that Anglosaur Lux is the, just the best thing to have out, because even if it's in Taurus, you're going to do damage. Sonosaurus, you're going to do damage. What's with everyone using Spino Constrictor? Has is, is the meta changed since I last... Looked? I don't know. Well, anyway, I think our counter takes away dodge anyway. Yeah, so... Oh, this Agnesol looks just very good. There's a lot of things that kill it very quick, don't get me wrong. But as as like an... In look, look at that, man. Look at that. Okay, so he's done a lot of bleed to me. A lot of bleed. Um, so now what we could do is just swap out. He'll do an attack to me, but I've got a shield up. And then I'll counter and kill him. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to uh, swap out. So here he's like, ha ha, I've got you. You hit me, you don't do much damage. And I survive and I kill you. So I think that was I think that was big brain play there. I could have stayed in and went for the, um, the instant hit and killed him. Because he was going to actually just go for regular attack, which is interesting. He wasn't going to swap. I would I would have thought he would have swapped, but hey ho. If you've got a... That tells me he doesn't have power tops. Because if he does have power tops, that would have been a perfect opportunity to swap out. Although maybe he just thought as long as I just stay in and he stays in, he dies? Oh, there it is. You see, that's what we kind of wanted to face with the... Uh, the what you call it? The Anglosaur looks. So, I mean, this one's... We've seen this a million times. He'll go for cloak. I'll go for my stun. Hopefully get the stun. If I don't, I'll try. It, it's it's basically RNG now for him. It's RNG whether he he gets stunned or whether he goes through the dodge. Okay, so he didn't get he didn't get stunned, but I did go through the dodge. He doesn't go through my dodge because that would have done a lot more damage. And now I think I'm in with a good chance to kill him in one hit here. If I get a crit, I think it's killed him, even if his dodge goes off. And oh. I hate to see it, but you know what? That's fine. Because now, we can guarantee that he dies by having the pocket dial out. Because it doesn't matter what happens here. Oh, even Rexy actually. Hell yeah! Should we do Rexy? <gasps> oh, I don't know. I feel like I want Rexy at the end. I, I haven't put in Rexy. Rexy's a good one. Should we? I don't know. Let's just freaking go for Rexy. Let's just go for Rexy. I want the speed boost, and then I just want to go for a big hit. Worst, worst thing that could happen, a full Rex or a, I mean, what what else is worse? A uh, referendum. Both are very highly used in this, this meta, so there's a high chance that one of those is going to come out. We'll see. Ah, would you look at that? Referendum. <laughs> Alright then, what are you going to do? You're going to go for your instant what? Are you going to go for the attack or are you going to nullify me? Oh, I thought you would have tried to nullify me. Interesting. I'm still going to do a lot of damage to you. So, I mean, this is it, right? Rexy's good, but it's not great. I think level 30, as long as you take out the ref on the team or the faux Rex, you, you, you can probably do a good amount of damage. Um, so now, the best thing to do is to swap an Anklos or Lux, because he's got nothing that can go through invincibility. He can't take my damage down, and we'll just do a hit on him. Oh! There was a chance to stun him. I completely forgot about that. <laughs> so this is invincibility because I'm below, I'm threatened, aren't I? And then here comes 2,000 damage. Just bang in. Now, I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a power tops because he would have used it before. Um, he doesn't have his... He needs to swap or he's lost. He just... Yeah. Hey, well, there you go. <laughs> I, think, I think I big brain played that. MVP there was 100% anger sword looks. Didn't even have to do an attack. Just stayed in and got its counter up. <laughs> Wow, that was amazing. I actually got a 4-0 or 4-1 win the other day. I was quite surprised. I can't remember what did it. I think it might have been Rexy. I think Rexy might have got Oh, the Imperator Sutures. The, the Crocodile. Whichever one. I think that one got it, actually. Okay, what we got? What we got? Give me something good. Give me something good. Oh, it's like the same team as before. <laughs> Except for instead of Scorpius Rex, we've got Gorgotrip Rex. It's fantastic. I mean, you, you've seen it, right? Ankylosaur Lux is just very, very good against... Um, most things. Right, so here we go with Schooner. 
let's see just how good is it against good. We've seen it against, you know, some of the other ones. Like, Referentum can instantly kill, basically. Uh, you saw it against... What was it? Just before... Yeah, well, you said it against Spino Constrictor. But Sonosaurus is another one that starts out a lot, or at least in the league I'm in, you see a lot of Sonosauruses. So to get that counter... I mean, you can reduce my speed, I suppose. But then he's probably going to do... Uh, wait, how much damage? Oh, he doesn't do enough. If I was going to be threatened, I'd be very happy. <laughs> Here it comes. Break encounter. So look at that. It's... You don't need a schooner. If you've got an Angrosaur Lux and it's heavily boosted, you do not need a schooner. Uh, oh, in comes the swap. Interesting. So, Paratops, are we thinking? Just to do a lot of damage, a Paratops would be a good idea. I mean, he's reduced my speed. A Referantum. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, okay. It's dead, but okay. <laughs> yeah, that... I would have just let your Skunosaurus at least do some damage to me. Because um, now I can do that much. Or I can do that much, actually. Yeah, should we just swap out? I mean, you're going to do this. But I don't want to die, so I don't want to take any more bleed. I don't think you can stun me either. Oh, no, maybe there is a chance to stun. No, no, that's it. No more stun. Come on, James. Head in the game. <laughs> there you go. Well, you wasted your ref. Cool. <laughs> I'm still above half health, which is a bit annoying because I can't swap in for uh, invincibility. Uh, but yes, here comes Rexy! Here go, Rexy! <laughs> There's no one I want to swap into, but hey oh, <laughs> It's here now! Right, what what does this person do? When faced up against a level 27 Rexy, they have their own Mortem Rex! Fantastic! Now do we go Ooh, how much damage can it do? It could do if it gets a crit, it's basically killed me. So I've gotta go for this. Oh! Okay! You know what? You've killed me. Fair enough. But at least I gotta do my dominant rule. How much damage do I do? It's a level 30 Mortem Rex. Oh, I get the crit as well. Oh, dear. You yeah, hate to see it. Uh, okay. I'm, I'm fast. I did it. I freaking did it, guys. Oh, wait, wait. No. Yes. Yes, Rex, you go. Yes. We need like a. There we go. Oh. I think it might have killed me. Oh, it... If it gets crit, no. Rexy! Oh, no, hold on, my bad. Rexy gets the kill! Oh, wait, no, it doesn't. <laughs> but I'm gonna get a lot of help, right? No. <laughs> oh, this is interesting. Uh, what's he gonna do just to regular hit? I think he's just gonna go for regular hit here. Uh, I'll, I'll swap in uh, Anglosaur Lux because if, it, if he goes for his basic hit, at least I've killed him. Um, if he goes for a shield, oh, that's unfortunate. If he went for a shield, he could have survived, but he hasn't. <laughs> Again, Anklasol looks being an MVP. Just so freaking good. Wow. 3 nil victory. Man, I'm lucky that. That was beautiful. Sorry, Nephlete. But that was beautiful to watch. So if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. And until next time, we'll be spending more money. I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.